I need to pee. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> you. Okay, well there you go. I think we already have something worth saying. Saying, yes. Something worth saying. And just as I pause too, you little bitch. Okay, we can level up again, so that's... That's I'm good. just quickly reading some stuff because I'm <laughs> bored and then I'm gonna go pee. You look, you look at a picture of like a water fountain. I need to pee. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're looking at like, uh, what, what do they call it? You're looking at like- We have the Niagara Falls. <laughs> You're looking at like, say, water sports? Hour, water sports? Hour. Oh god, why did I say that? Just like watching a 10 hour loop of the Niagara <laughs> Falls. <laughs> like, oh. <laughs> and just hear people go, look at all that falling water. It makes me want to take a piss. Good thing and there's a, <laughs> good thing there's a toilet right next to me. And you're, and you're just sitting there for like, your legs cr like curled over like eight times. <laughs> I really need to take a piss. Good thing there's a toilet right next to me. Like you know, just you over the the, the, the like, waterfall. They just shut the door. <laughs> like they start peeing, and all you see is like the pee coming out the back. No, you, the, yeah, like, you can just or something going over <laughs> the waterfall. You, you can just hear the water like hitting the uh, hitting the water in the toilet, and it's you know. When he flushes, it just goes into the Niagara Falls. He's just taking a piss, <laughs> and then he flushes it. Like, whoosh, like, whoosh, like, oh, that's better. Oh, I'm glad I took that piss just now. The next what we hear is, oh, oh took a shit on my head. <laughs> I feel so much better after that piss, and you're just like, oh my god. <laughs> it's like uh, some other the Niagara Falls. <laughs> it's got it all over the head. Uh, hold on, I'm gonna check the strength requirement for the spear, actually. Oh god, imagine if someone masturbated in that toilet. Oh, god. Do people do that? Do people actually masturbate in, in toilets? Well, there's glory holes in toilets, so... What a glory hole? Oh, you're right, yeah, never mind. Oh, I was that's... about to say, are you fucking serious? <laughs> oh, man. Glory holes are gross. Everyone knows what they are. 11 strength. Well, actually, I had to get Mike tell me the other day, because I didn't fucking know. I mean, I had a guess, but I didn't actually... I think that was actually what it was. Okay, okay, 11 strength, so I can now hold the spear. So there's that at least, and I do slightly more damage too. Uh, shall I get I some remember, more? Oh yeah, I I'll get. A horror game I had on the PlayStation called uh, two called The uh, Suffering. Okay, I'll get uh, one more stamina and endurance as well. Okay. Oh, is story? I got. I have a hundred stamina now. Awesome. That's another story. Uh. All right, sorry. What was that story about? Anyway, when I was younger, I had a um, PlayStation, a couple of uh, PlayStation two games called uh, the Suffering One and Two. Unfortunately, oh, oh, oh. I never was able to finish number one. It, I, it was too difficult for me at that age. But I was able to finish number two. I got to the final boss. I was like, "Yay! I'm gonna defeat him!" And it was so fucking easy. <laughs> I pushed a button. And one. All right. Well, now that we're talking about that, you want me to tell you some experiences I had with the, the Metal Gear games? Oh shit! Well, like, um, so I just pushed one button, which did like an ultimate attack thing, <laughs> and it beat the final boss. It's like One Punch Man. I, I did. I didn't even see the final boss anywhere. I had enemies surrounding me, so I did it to get rid of them, and it killed the final boss. <laughs> no, see. I've played, uh, I've played the first four Metal Gear Solid games, and it's questionable to say that it might not, uh, might be the only games you really need to play. Like, maybe you could play, you know, like, you know, the, um, what you was it? don't need to play number five. Maybe you could play, you know, like, Metal Gear Rising, because it, it is actually kind of a, an interesting spin-off, but... You don't yeah. need to play number five. Yeah, you don't need to play number five. But Just give it all together. Sorry for interrupting, but I was like... I can understand back in the day when AI was stupid, the cardboard box trick working. <sighs> But with how oh, oh, oh. Creation, how we create things nowadays, the AI we have, that trick doesn't work anymore. It should not work anymore. Like, I think I I've learned how to clip a cardboard box working in the middle of a desert. <laughs> it's like, seriously, there's no cardboard boxes out in this area. Why would you fall for this? Now I'm pretty sure that works in Metal Gear Solid Three. I'm pretty sure, like, because you know, it's almost all in the jungle. I think if you're in the jungle, the box doesn't actually work, if I remember correctly. Like, they're just uh, like... This, uh, with the clip I saw, it worked in, like, the desert. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? You can't do that. Oh, I need to heal. expect to get away with Ow! it. Ow! Oh, no, 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 no! 
Okay, I, died. I did say that if I lost my humanity, like, permanently, as in if I actually lost this soul, mm -hmm. if I die one more time, I'm, I'm gone. Oh. I okay. found out a, f a couple of interesting things. One about ac one actually about a Metal Gear Solid game was that if I think it's with the fifth one, that if you play it on easy and die a few times, you will get a chicken head that you can't take off, which will make you like, which is like embarrassing enough as it is, but wearing it will make the enemy see you easier. <laughs> What, if you play uh, Metal Gear Solid 5 on easy? On easy mode and die a few times. <laughs> oh, I love it. And another, there's a few games out there that if you played on easy mode, you literally cannot finish the game. Oh, wait, hold on. I got eight souls now. Oh, right, because I'm hollowed again. You mean humanity? Yeah, I, I got... I, well, I got eight human souls again, so I'm... I'm... Um, I'm hollowed, so I'm just gonna reverse that hollow because I I want to be normal. There's one game that I remember. Considering humanity seeing... is my extra life, yeah. so I need to keep that. I remember uh, seeing a game that you finish like the first stage and it's like, it, like has a picture of like saying you can't continue, like saying you can't continue until you beat this level on normal or hard, like do it properly and stuff like that. <laughs> Um, Earthworm Jim has something like that. Does it? Yeah, if you finish it, like, on easy, you don't get the actual ending, you get... Oh, wait, no, and wait. I don't know what Earth Earthworm Jim is, actually. I was thinking Toe Jam and it's Earl. A, it's a very, very, very old game. I was, well, Toe Jam and Earl is very old as well. About, uh, a worm in a white suit that has, like, has arms and legs and, like, he uses his head whip thing, stuff like that. It's very old. Damn, this guy actually looks kind of cool, doesn't he? <laughs> actually, quite um, like it. If you play, finish it on easy mode, instead of getting the ending, which is another about, like another third of the game or something like that, um, it, you hear like a 10 minute voice clip of the creator going, congratulations, you did this on easy, <laughs> great job. And then well done! Soccer. Like, he, but that's does it with a very condescending tone. Your sarcasm. Like, yeah, good yeah. job. You I did love it. it. And well then he starts, done. like, going on, like, saying really stupid facts. Oh, holy shit, I never noticed the worms. stairs here. Whoa! Yeah, How really have I never seen those stairs? about worms, like, saying something that uh, worms and elephants have in common. They have really big ears and stuff like that. Um, do they? <laughs> Just oh, saying oh, stuff oh. like that for finishing the game on easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Um... Uh, there's another game, I can't remember what game it was, but if you finished it on easy and died at all during it, you got an achievement or trophy worth zero points <laughs> for dying on easy mode. Man, this scimitar is really fast. I love it. Oh, oh, ow. Uh, like, game creators are such trolls sometimes. Oh, but it's great. Yeah, I, I've never played, like, the first time I play through a game, I've never, I never play it on easy, and I never play it on hard. I always do, like, the mid-difficulty. Uh, well, as for me, uh, almost every game I play, I'm always, I'm almost always on normal and hard difficulty. That's my jam. I only go hard if, like, go to the hard difficulty if... You go hard when you see men. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been down that's here. Why I had, that's why I had to change the sentence. Yeah, I knew you did, I but I I had to go to the hard difficulty when... I've played it a few times, or if it's becoming not oh, a challenge oh. anymore, or something like that. I go to the hard difficulty event. Yeah, um, I, I sometimes I even need to mod a game to make it harder, like uh, Full F3 and stuff. You haven't really played those, have you? No. Yeah, I didn't think so. Right, well, it's an RPG. You know that. Oh shit! I, I know. Whoa. I know what all that is. Hold on, there's someone here. Well, now. The merchant. You seem to have your wits about you. Then you are a welcome customer. Is he meant to be I'll an Australian? Souls. Everything's for sale. <laughs> he sounds like an Australian. Racist. <laughs> to my own kind! Um, okay, Your can I sell kind. stuff? Can I sell stuff? I've never done this before! Holy crap, you get chain armor! I didn't fucking know this shit! Oh, I never found him. I never saw the staircase before. Oh shit, it's fucking rapier. Oh my god. I love rapiers. Oh, they're so good, aren't they? They're like a, they're like a very lightweight. I love to rape, yeah. You like to rape Pierre? <laughs> <laughs> I love to rape you. you. You'd like to rape you. 
Uh, like, can we take it three? That name, like, last sentence can be taken in three different ways. You have to rape Pierre. Rape Pierre? Yeah. You have to rape Pierce. <laughs> I can think of. And like to rape. And like the worst one is like you like to rape her. Or you like to rape Pierre. Yeah. Rape you. I'd like to I rape you. Yeah. So four, like four different ways. But like <laughs> the worst one is I like to rape her. I like to rape a raper. Oh no, no. I like the raper raper. <laughs> I like the way you move. That was terrible. It was. Uh, oh, a buckler. Okay, so I, I got like the shield. Oh. Was it? What? Oh. What was the shield I had? Yeah. Oh, you fuck. Go and fall off a cliff. <laughs> fuck you, mate. He's uh, trying to send you a message, Joel. Okay, I got a leather shield and wooden shield. I don't really care to have the wooden shield. Oh. I still need to piss. <laughs> uh, can I actually sell stuff in this game? I actually have no idea. Oh, residence key. That might be good. Opens residences in Undeadburg. Ooh. Bottomless box. A box allowing inventory management at bonfire. Hold on, is it 3,000? Oh, it's 3,000. I'm not paying 3,000 for that. I don't even know what it does. Oh, 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 can I buy a bow? It's kind of obvious what the key does. Can I buy a bow here? Oh, yes, I can buy a bow here. Fuck yes. It's kind of obvious what the key does. Yeah, but, I mean, I mean, what does it open? That's All the question. All residences in the town. Well, I mean... That's literally How many doors is said. the question? How many doors will it be effective? And what treasures will be found inside? Are they worth the 3,000 golds I'm investing in? Most likely. I don't know if I can buy that. Um, okay, this is at least 600 souls, so I'll grab a short burr. Sure. sure. And then. I'll... a short burr. Oh, oh, right, there's crossbows in this game. Oh, I'd probably fancy getting one of those. But they're not going to be very good in boss battles, probably. Because, you know, they're so f fucking slow. Um, large arrows... Oh, they're not very expensive. I, I'd assume they probably run out of use. They're, they're probably like a one use item. Mm. Maybe they refill like magic does at the fireplaces. I guess we'll find out. Oh, yeah, looks like they run out. God, they're expensive. Um, I guess I'll buy 20. They're 50, they're 50 an hour. That's expensive. All right, we'll, we'll go for the cheaper stuff then. Um, this is 10 an hour. We'll grab 30 arrows. Uh, now, do we want to buy chain? Mm. Mm. Is oh, maybe ch the stats? A leather gauntlet. Uh, is it better than what I have? Is the real question. So that's what I just said. Is there any way to compare the stats? Oh, throwing knives. I wonder how it's better range than fireball. Prepare. Prevent oh. this recovery within a limited area. Uh, I don't even know what that. I don't. Uh, talisman utilizes. Okay, but uh, in the outside world, the undead are cursed creatures, the lowest cleric knights. Are... Oh, oh! I see. It means enemies can't use them. Yeah, within the limited area. I'm not used to okay. I, I need to piss. Okay, we'll, we'll just pause then. We'll be right back.